What's up, y'all? It's Uncle Bones in the game. We're back with another reaction video. Today, we're reacting to Dex Eminem Houdini Remix One Take Video. Let's go. Make sure you go and like and subscribe to my channel. Um, we're on the road to 500 subscribers. Guys, let's hit that subscribe button, bro. Like, come on. Yeah, so we're gaining it. Let's go. Neither. Hmm. Hey, Blackie, I thought you were hmm. quitting rap. Why don't you put the hmm. water Malone down and answer my question? I did say that, but I didn't say when. Oh, <laughs> okay, well, make sure you do this beat just. Uh, me too, I was surprised when he said he's quitting rap. I'm like, nah, I, know he's I know he's not going to quit. I know, I know, that's a fact. This Eminem might be watching. I. Bet. Yo, hey, record. Guess who's back on an Eminem beat? They renegade dirty like just last week. I'm the definition of hard in my rap jeans. Seem fitted to fit 1973 back when rap. Oh. <laughs> he said, I'm the definition of hard when you check out my rap jeans. You hear me? He's trying to say. <laughs> That's a double ball, bro. He's trying to say that I'm hard, you know. You can see in my rap jeans, like in my jeans, my actual jeans, like in terms of life science. And he's also talking that I'm hard. You can see in terms of my rap jeans. He's talking about his tight jeans. That is the definition of hard. <laughs> okay, that's a bar. That's a bar. Let's go. Just last week, I'm the definition of hard in my rap jeans. Seen fitted to fit 1973, back when rap started and was first created. And America was dealing with stagnant wages. The Vietnam War, mass inflation, and Watergate that had just caught the resignation of President Nixon. Everybody was shocked. Then a new genre came and greased the cock. Jacked off mainstream, came and rocked every genre known country to pop. Hi, I'm Dax, the illegitimate son of mainstream rap. If you ain't never heard of my music, it's cause that it doesn't propagate destroy you in the middle class. I touch. Oh. He said, hi, my name is Dax, bro. I'm the one who makes that music, you know. And if you don't know about me, it's because I make that type of music that does not look down on the middle class. Okay, okay, okay. That's fact. That's fact. Most of his songs, right, is like he's, he's fighting for most, actually not just people in the middle class. He includes everybody in, in what he's, he raps about. That's what I like about Dax. And rock the very genre known country to pop. Hi, I'm Dax, the illegitimate son of mainstream rap. If you ain't never heard of my music, it's cause that it doesn't propagate destroy you in the middle class. I touch on taboo topics like porn addiction and the dangers of constant pussy popping. I've never tried drugs, but to be honest, I'm a very high functioning alcoholic. I'm a straight Christian who's not registered. <laughs> he said, I've never tried drugs, but I'm a very functioning, highly, you know, alcoholic. <laughs> So what was the song for um, Dear Alcohol, bro? Like, I thought he was making that song to say that he stopped drinking or something, bro. That's one thing you should, guys, you should remember. In terms of drinking, right, you can you can genuinely stop, but most people, they don't really stop. They just take a break. They know the difference between taking a break and stopping. In the middle class, I touch on taboo topics like porn addiction and the dangers of constant pussy popping. I've never tried drugs, but to be honest, I'm a very high-functioning alcohol. I'm a straight Christian who's not registered to vote. I got seven and a half inches down below. I went to three universities and just about four and almost got kicked out because I'm lying assholes. One had a boyfriend, second wouldn't give dome. Started calling me names, so I made her walk home. Third was a new menu woman's volleyball coach who had made false claims to destroy my name. Then took me to court, but she lost. She must have had a brain to sword because she got a restraining order, but assaulted me. That doesn't make sense. Like, <laughs> oh, he said, he said, the last girl I dated, she must have had a brain disorder because. She got a restraining order against him, but she's the one who attacked him. Like, make it make sense, guys. But she lost. She must have had a brain and sword because she got a restraining order, but assaulted me. That doesn't make sense. Like, people thinking that men and women can be friends. I'm the scientific definition of a movement. No racial tension in my ascension. It's men and women oh. can be friends. I'm the scientific what did he say? She got a and assaulted me. That doesn't make sense. Like, people thinking that men and women can be friends. I'm the scientific facts facts that is facts that is facts he said that doesn't make sense to me like the same way as men and women can be friends that's bro i've been saying this bro there's no such thing as male and female friendship especially when you're dating bro. why how can you be saying i love my girl 
friend with all of my heart or i love my boyfriend with all of my heart and still you have your male bestie or your female bestie that's i won't lie to me. i won't lie to you guys that's just disgusting to me bro like when you have a, when you have someone in your life right you should cut off all those things which uh you know exuberates or perpetuates you not being loyal you feel me you don't say hey i've been friends with them for you. i don't care bro if i'm with you all of the male friends you made or whatever they stop the moment we start dating that's just me guys that's just me that's just actually that should be facts bro that shouldn't be something that should be uh, argued about it's just facts who had made false claims to destroy my name then took me to court but she lost she must have had a brain and sword because she got restrained in order but assaulted me that doesn't make sense like people thinking that men and women can be friends i'm the scientific definition of a movement no racial tension in my ascension it's because of my skill and how i paid attention to my lifestyle and made it cost effective i'm a honda driving target shopping panty pinching some clothes were son of a gun i don't flex for the grand we're designer brands and i can confidently say that i'm not a thug i pay all my taxes drink starbucks like real bodies and not all that plastic your bbl suck when you dump your truck how the hell do you guys even wipe your asses i'm left-handed <laughs> No, oh, he said I like mine's natural, bro. Not those people who are starting to take those ass shots. You feel me? All those crazy stuff which amplifies you or makes you to be someone who you are not. He said, how do you even wipe your... Not even gonna say it. I'm not even gonna say it. Plastic or BBL suck when you dump your truck. How the hell do you guys even wipe your asses? I'm left-handed, unorthodox. I uppercut the game with these hooks I drop. They try to put me in a box, but they can't contain. I jab right cross over to a different lane. I'm on a roll, rock your stage, just entertain and scream and vote Donald Trump the assassin. Attempt on his life in my estimation We'll plan by a secret organization The best in the game, I'm a mastermind A mastermind, clones and inflection mind Metaphors do more and fortify And gross with the likes of a fortune five They're mad at me cause you're not forced to like mine Core principles which impose a right Realistic sight in this world disguise As a playground run by pedophiles I'm ahead by miles And I can't slow down, it's criminal activity Push capitalism, jack prices of gas Tax us to the max, tell us Joe Biden was just sharp as a tack Then have Kamala follow the aftermath And try to convince and garner the votes of black Political trap will place this republic Cannot be a republic if the democrats Drag Biden's ass through a campaign Avoid the primary just so they can place a plant Replace a vegetable and make a dance Bring it with feminism and rainbow flags I'm not even into political themes I just had a dream that That is facts bro, that is facts bro Like if you watch the what we are seeing lately in life bro Like uh, wherever you go, especially on your phones on social media, whatever wherever you go, you see this LGBTQ movement. Hey, I don't even want to speak on that topic because I don't want to get banned. But bro, like, I don't have a problem with these people. I have a problem when they start pushing their movements on us. You feel me? That's 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 what I don't like, bro. You can't you can't be perpetuating perpetu hey, English perpetuating this stuff upon the social media when you know there's mostly kids using it. What are you trying to say to the world? What are you trying to push? I, that's crazy, bro. And make a dance, bring a little with feminism and rainbow flags. I'm not even into political themes. I just had a dream that maybe we're not a democracy, but rather a bougie oligarchy. And side note, I hate the movie Barbie. This family's at feud. Where is Steve Harvey? I'm starting to smell civil war. I can taste the propaganda being made. It's practically dripping through my pores. I don't even want to rap no more. So if you ask what I'm even rapping for, just know I got bored of the mainstream wave that's washed up shore that you all ride on a shitty surfboard. I wasn't made in China. I'm not in stores. Taiwan, I knew Korea. I screamed to bask in something else instead of robbing you of vanilla. Content that is all just feel. Mine's too deep. That's why they try to ignore me because I got the scoop on all their I can just say with a uh, hundred percent certainty, bro is just having fun with this one, bro. <laughs> hey, uh, Eminem needs to respond to Dax, guys, or maybe a song or just something, bro, to show that he's at least watching, bro, because Dax is not playing around, bro. 
Yeah, it's been your boy Uncle Bones. If you like my reaction, go drop a like and comment to what other songs you want me to react to.